Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Welcome if you're new. I'm Stacy, and today we are going to be unboxing something a little different. It is the Grabby um, scrapbooking box. I want to do um, scrapbooking, uh, art journaling. Not scrapbooking, art journaling. I don't like scrapbooking. I've tried it. It's not. I'm not a fan. Uh, it's not, I, I just don't like it. It's not my thing. It's too structured. <coughs> now, art journaling and adding in photos and art and pictures and writings and decorative things is right up my alley. So I thought I would get the scrapbooking grabby box um, subscription. Isn't their packaging amazing? This is so nice. It's a cute little box. I may keep it for... I got smudged a little, but that's okay. Um, for um, Christmas. A little cute little grabby sticker. And their tissue... I don't want to rip all the tissue paper. Look at their tissue paper. That's so pretty. That sticker's right on there, isn't it? There we go. Yeah, where those scissors go? There we go. Boop, boop, boop. There. Look at that. That's really pretty. Happy time. It's a nice big piece, too. This is gorgeous. It's folded in half. Yeah, definitely going to save that. The creator in me. And, wow, this is the box. First, here's our sticker. Grabby sticker. Um, I don't know that I'll stick this on anything. I'll probably give it to my granddaughter. She loves stickers. <coughs> and right out of the gate, these are what um, grab my attention. The fact that we get actual ink and there's an ink plate. Um, today, or maybe I should. Give that a little roll. There we go. And an ink plate. It's a little grubby, but that's okay. I can clean it. Um, yeah, these are nice. Uh, this is... I actually don't have my glasses on. Um, pure palette. Uh, great, uh, pigment ink stamp pad. Glay shades. Um, and a green... I, I don't speak the languages, so I don't know what color this is. But this is a beautiful green. And this one looks like a red-brown. We'll play with them. And then we have a little grabby Happy Holidays um, booklet. Let's see. Grabby Scrapbook Club box for December. Now, I did think I was getting the, the November box. I really want the November box, so I'll have to um, <coughs> go back and purchase that. But um, yeah, this is nice. A little booklet tells us what we get. May the art be with you. <laughs> that's funny. But that's nice. I love the festive little setup we got going on. And then we have a pad of Orange Christmas. Um, turn the socks over and hang them inside out. The whole world is your gift. All right. And then inside is all of this, um, beautiful, let's see what we get. Is there bunches of different ones? Yeah, there's different ones. Looks like two different kinds, right? I don't know, there's more than two. And they're little, are these stickers? Or are they paper? Oh, these are little stickers? I'm so confused. Hold on. I thought they were a little, a little pad of papers, but they're little punch-outs, little tear-outs. Okay, neato. Or you could use it as paper, too. You don't have to <coughs> tear it out. You can see um, on the back, the little 
fold, like, there we go, perforations, little folds where you can punch up little, little bits. Yeah, that's fun. Okay, cool. So we got that. And to go with our stamp pad, we have this beautiful, um, this is one of the things that grabbed my attention. I'll put some white behind it. Um, with this box, what I saw on the Instas was all of these beautiful stamps. They're gorgeous. And I will use these over and over and over again. Um, yeah, they're really pretty. Uh, we'll see how they stamp, hopefully beautifully. But I like that um, they're protected by the sleeve, by this little sheet. They're stuck right on there. And these are, um, there's a picture on this one of what your stamp is so that you can put it back in the same spot and keep it protected when you're not using it, which I think is great. Because uh, I'm terrible about keeping things like this together. So that's that's what our stamps are. we got a sleigh, ho ho ho, a gingerbread, Christmas ornaments, bells, silent night, gloves, snowflakes, a little candy cane with a bow. The deer is fantastic. I love the, the Santa sleigh. And the tree is really pretty too. Yeah, I, I dig it. I, I'm excited for this box. Really excited. And then, let's see. Let's move our box out of the way. We'll put it off to the side so that we can really enjoy the other things that are in it. Let's see. The next thing is this grabby pouch. Oh, this is our stickers. <gasps> I'm already excited. I'm already so excited. They put a little sticker over the top. Can I get that off? Not really. We'll just... Do we need to tear it? I don't really want to tear that. Here. We don't need to. I'm getting overexcited. I'm coming here with the scissors and just, just snip that. Because this bag I will reuse for other things. All about reusing things. Let's see what we get. Oh, look at these. My granddaughter's going to lose her mind. My two and a half year old granddaughter loves stickers. Um, so I may end up having to share some of these. <laughs> oh, let's see. Um, look at the, oh. oh, look. Oh, these are so nice. I got all whiny. Okay, all right. This. Oh, all right. Let's look at this pack first. Oh, I'm so excited. These are nice, you guys. Let's see what the how luxurious they feel. I am so excited. Let's pull out. Come on. All of these guys. We'll put them back in when I'm done playing with them. Oh, these are really nice. They feel nice. They're not thick. They're just paper stickers. Um, but yeah, we've got little... Oh my gosh. Look at that. How sweet is that? Little deer. We've got little... I'm going to zoom in a bit. There we go. We've got little wreaths. Let's say Merry Christmas. There's oh, a little cabin. These are so sweet. Little windows, little cabins. Looking like two of everything. This is nice. This is well worth the money. Oh my gosh. Cute little gingerbreads. Oh, look at the little squirrel dude. We have very um, aggressive squirrels here. <laughs> Squirrels. Oh, this is gorgeous. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, this is up my alley for sure. Cute little mailboxes and lanterns. Oh, look at that. Little fireplace. They do have a little bit of shine, but not too much. And there's two of each. Ooh, each one of these stickers in this little pouch. Um,. So tell me that's not worth the money. Little, oh, she loves hearts. She'll love this. 
I might sort out some that she'll really, really like and give them, put them in a little basket for her for Christmas. She'll love that. Little Christmas trees, Santa Christmas trees, and oh, a Christmas log. <coughs> oh, ooh. Look at him. How are you not inspired by these? Oh, there's a little fox. And another little birdhouse and a barn. Oh, look at the barn. <gasps> and then a Santa. Oh, these are nice. You guys. Oh, all right. I'm a little whiny and I'm a little overexcited. I didn't even notice um, that instead of going through the whole bag, I could have just shown you the back of the <laughs> the back of the... Um, it tells you what you get inside. So it's not quite the same as looking at the actual stickers, though. So fun. All right. And then this one. This video might be a little long. This one. Ooh. These are cool. They feel a little, um... Oh, these are, um... Oh, these are those clear stickers. Oh, these are nice. I'm going to need something white. <laughs> Here. Let's grab a sheet of watercolor paper. Look at these, you guys. Look at those guys. And they got a little shimmer to them. Ah, dreamy. Look at these. A carousel. A ribbon. Let's just spread them out on here. What do we get? That's probably easiest, right? To spread them out. Oh, look at that carousel. Oh, that's pretty. They all got a little sparkle to them. Look at it. So, so cute. I am beyond excited. Look at all the different ones. Mm. Digging it. Digging it. Look at the Christmas trees. These feel very vintage. They feel very vintage. Let's spin this around. It's a little Christmas um, <coughs> snacks, Christmas snacks, but look, it's got little bits of sparkle, <gasps> so fun, oh yeah, these are, these are great, these are fantastic, we've got a couple of different trees, we've got some with a little fence, and we've got some without, let's scooch this up into frame, and then we've got a couple candy canes. Those are really beautiful. Some ribbons. Um, oh, look at that. Merry Christmas. That's so great. They're very slippery. <laughs> and our snacks. I like this one, this little cart. That's cute. We've got jingle bells, a couple different kinds of bells, and some, um, like these bells are the same as over there. Here we go. Let's do a little close-up of all of these guys. Oh, dreamy. Which one's your favorite, favorite? See, they oh, focus. They each have a little bit of shine. Uh, I kind of really dig this guy right here. Yeah, he's cool. Alright, so that's that set. <laughs> <coughs> Isn't that cute? Look at all the a couple different Christmas trees. Yeah, these are nice. Alright, let's... 
slide them off. They're clingy. There we go. Very nice. This is a nice set of stickers. Um, Christmas bronzed pet sticker set. I don't know why it's a pet sticker set, but it is very cute. Um, and then we got more. 30. This one had 30 pieces. This one, there we go, 25 pieces. I mean, I spent $45 total, 46 with, you know, with change. It was 45 and change. Because um, when you subscribe, it's they give you a little deal um, for this whole box and we're not even halfway through yet oh my gosh let's scooch those let's set this back here so you guys can actually see this is um I can't really tell on um, I mean I could show you the back it's not quite as nice as going through the stickers though Oh, these are pretty. Look at that packaging. I'll use this too. That's pretty. Okay, these are gorgeous. These have a little bit of bronze on them. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. Alright, I dig that. These are pretty. Little, little holly leaves with bronze in the middle. Oh, I am digging it. Ooh, that's pretty. Mistletoe. And then they're all upside down. Sorry. There's a little bit of... Oh, there's a pretty Merry Christmas. Come on. The Merry Christmas part is bronzed. It'll probably show up better on the paper. Let's flip these guys over. <laughs> Reflip these. Oh man, these are really pretty. Oh, I can't wait. I'm. I just cannot wait to start putting together my art journals and using these for um, decorating. How great are these? This one says holiday on it. Cute. Cute, cute. Alright guys, I, my fingernails are not helping me here. <laughs> that guy there. This, oh that one's pretty. I think the other one's right here, yeah. That's pretty too. I'll set them like that. Little flowers with debris for de decoration. And then scoot some of these guys around so that they all fit. Two of those. And there's two of everything. I just have things mixed up a little bit. Um, yeah, these guys are kind of sticking to each other. Are they? Oh no, I just have had it in the weird light. <coughs> but yeah. Check them out. They have little bronze shimmers. Each each one has little bronze shimmers on them. Ah oh, dreamy. Look at those guys. Aren't they pretty? They're so pretty. The attention to detail, they're really nice. I don't know why I'm so surprised. I really don't. Because, I know why I'm surprised. Because the grabby box for the art supplies um, didn't throw me at all. I, I was not excited by it or um I did get one 
but I was n not, I was underwhelmed. Let's just say it's not a bad box. If you're learning, if you're a beginner, um, it's probably a great way to go to get introduced to a plethora of art supplies. But I have so many professional art supplies at my disposal that I don't really need um, uh, more student grade learning supplies, I guess is the way to say that. <coughs> but if you're learning or you're just interested, um, it's a great box for that. Okay, let's see. <gasps> Look at these. Oh my gosh. Look at these. These are gorgeous. Wow. What are these? Well, there's a bunch of them. I should just get the book thing in. Look, those are beautiful. Don't you think? They're so pretty. There's a bunch of different ones. Are they stickers or are they just cut windows? Where's that book thing? Where'd the book go? There you are. Come here. <sighs> Clear polymer stamps. Stamp block. A pad. Um, I, I really don't know what these are. It doesn't really say on there. Um, I don't think they're stickers. I don't. I don't know anything about scrapbooking, you guys. Or I mean, I don't know a lot about journaling. Are these stickers? I don't think so. But they are beautiful. I will definitely use them. They're floral. It's uh, the butterfly themed. Are there two of each? No, they're all different. Wow. That's awesome. There's round ones. There's square ones. That one. Are we in frame? Isn't that pretty? These are really pretty. I was not expecting this. These are nice. They're gorgeous. All right, I'll figure something out. That would be beautiful with pictures underneath them. Beautiful. I can see my grandbabies in those. Yeah, I'm excited. Like I'm getting a little misty. I gotta stop talking about it. <laughs> I'll set those up there. And then there's these, are the last ones that were in this pouch. <gasps> Look at these. These are sticker sheets. Oh my goodness. These are beautiful. <gasps> oh, um, Astrid's going to love the flowers. She liked the snowmen too, but I, I might want those for me. <laughs> she loves flowers. Look at all of those. The snowman ones are particularly up right up my alley. The flowers are beautiful, but they're not really up my alley. Um, let's do a little close up. They've all got, they're just really pretty. A little bit of glimmer to them. Look at the snowman. They got little bits of shine and sparkle. Ah. Uh, I, and they look watercolored, so that's what's really grabbing me on those. The fact that these look like stained glass to me, and these look like watercolors, which is right up my alley. Ah, oh, dreamy, dreamy, you guys. Ah, oh, so excited. Okay, and then there. Oh yeah, and then there's these guys, which are absolutely beautiful. Are these stickers as well? No, yes, no. I don't know. If anyone knows, let me know. Or they're just die cuts. I don't know what die cuts. I I hear the phrase thrown about. But um man. Talk about shimmery. It's 
about to blind you. Aren't they pretty? They're so pretty. Several different si sizes, right? A couple small ones. Um, a couple longer, narrow ones. These little littler dudes. A couple of bigger dudes. The smaller, the narrow one. This one's really pretty. Look at that. Aren't they gorgeous? Can't even get over it. Can't even. Look at that. Beautiful. Not pretty laid out like that. <laughs> I'm going to zoom out a little bit. So you can see all of them at once. Oh, isn't that pretty? <laughs> Again, they look like stained glass. Look at that shimmer. Those are beautiful. I want to hang those in a window. They're a little white on the back, so you can't really do that, but that that's really gorgeous. All right, so there's those. <laughs> oh, I've never had, well, not never. <coughs> I really am enjoying myself. All right, so that's that pouch. And then, oh, there's, there's more things. Oh, look at all this. Oh, okay. So there's another pouch and there's a bunch of papers. All right, where's my pouch? All right, let's put our stickers back in our sticker pouch. Where's our stickers? Let's scooch those guys in and all of our, so they stay protected. I don't want to get them ruined. That would bum me right out. Let's put those back in there. All right. Let's look at our papers. Oh, these are nice. These are cute. Vintagey, right? Kind of digging it. That old world Christmas. There's Christmas goose. And then the plaid. Ooh, those are nice. My true love gave to me, making a list on the first day of Christmas. My true love gave to me. A partridge. Now that's gonna be stuck in your head. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Oh, there's different ones. Oh, these are cool drummers drumming. <gasps> oh, I love these. Oh, that's pretty vintage. Like, slightly washed out look. This is really pretty. Yeah, I'm, I'm really liking this. Maids of milking, ladies dancing, French hens. Oh, that's funny. Look at that. Little silhouettes of what they are for the 12 days of Christmas. That's fantastic. Yeah, take it. Look at the pears. Four calling birds. Oh, I haven't sung that song in forever. That blue one's pretty. Eight maids of milking. Oh, th yeah, I'm digging this. I, uh, this is pretty cool. Oh, look at that. This, yeah. Ladies dancing, ten lords leaping. Pretty. That was really busy. Oh, that's pretty. The note paper underneath all the flowers. Yeah, that's that's nice. All right, yeah, this is this is nice. I'm I am thrilled. All right, and then another whole nother pouch of stuff. Kapow! This is our paper pouch. Isn't that nice? I can keep them all in here so that they don't get um, ruined, cause you know, cause you know. Okay, we've got cutouts, which. Honestly, me being me, <laughs> I would use these as stencils. Instead of as cutouts. But, yeah. Got numbers. Let's see what else is in here. Just quickly, yeah, I think these are all numbers in different um, little sizes and cutouts. These are all numbers. 
Ooh, one just popped right out of there. Did you see that? Escapee. I'm just going to leaf through real quick. Yeah, these are all numbers. The paper's really nice. It's got a slight um, texture to it. It's got a slight little texture to it. If you can tell. Some of them, and some are smooth. This one's got textures. Focus. Focus. There we go. It's got little textures on it. These are fun. Okay. I'll figure something out to do with them. Most likely, though, <laughs> I would use them as stencils. <coughs> I'm going to pop them back in here real quick. Oops. Hopefully real quick. They're nice. They've got little shapes and little little decorative accents on them as well, which is nice. And honestly, I will use these probably as um, some sort of stencil. I'll pull some out to use as stencils and some to use as um, embellishments. So there's those. And then there's all these papers. All right, how are we going to do this? Let's set these over here. Let's do this pile first. And I'm not going to do each page because that's just silliness, but um, we can flip through and you can get a feel. Lots of birds. But, ooh, the butterfly is pretty. Birds and butterflies. Yeah, this... I'm going to that over. Now these are cut to size, probably from larger sheets, but the paper's um, thin, meant to be used as like decorative embellishments and whatnot, but there's a lot going on on all of them, right? I said I wasn't going to go through them one by one, but I'll probably at some point sort them by birds and butterflies so that they're um, <coughs> the way I want them to be. But yeah, aren't they beautiful? They're really nice. Different colors, lots of different textures. I dig it. And then the next pile. Ooh, I like this. Well, these got a little sparkle on them. Can you see the sparkle? Yeah. There's a, a night nice sky, a starry sky, snowflakes. Oh, these are pretty. And they're embossed. Is that what you call it? No, that's not what you call it. I forget what you call this. Bumped. Is that right? Let me know. Okay, so we got snowflakes in blue and white. And then there's a different, couple different night skies moons and stars and then this one's more like half moons and different kinds of stars oh, look at that. yeah and they all have a little bit of sparkle to them more snowflakes and more stars and little bits of this could be snow this one looks like snow to me shooting stars and planets this one's just stars Ooh, and look at that. That's very vintagey feeling to me. Those are pretty. Can you tell? There we go. There we go. These you can tell far away what's on them, but yeah, these are cool. I kind of, I kind of really dig these. Super nice. What do you guys think? I kind of like the snowflake ones best. This white one and this blue one. Yeah. Super cool. Okay, so that's those ones. And then there's another pouch. There's pouches everywhere. What is this? Romantic snow. Romantic, huh? What about that? <laughs> A little 
of a card. Oh, these are delicate. That's why. All right. I might not get these back in there. <laughs> what do we have? Oh, these are pretty. That, that, these are pretty. I love these, you guys. Check them out. Oh, they're very rainbowy from this angle. Can you tell? Oh, there's some rainbow action. That's wild. Do we have a, a couple of each one, probably? They're very delicate feeling. I hope I don't ruin them before I get a chance to use them. Let go. Oh, that one bent a little. Are they bendy? Are these metal? Are these like a lightweight metal? Feels like it. Look how pretty. Are you guys doing this as much as I am? <laughs> and there's... Pull that guy off and put that one there. We'll pull this guy off and we'll put this one. He Ooh, that one's pretty. Look at that one. That's different. Put that guy off. Ooh, look at this one. Oh, so nice. So nice. I am in love. What's this? The little stickers. Okay. Snowflakes are rolling down. Snowflakes are dancing in the air. Snowflakes are loose. I can't read that. Um, agencies of ice crystals. Uh, Yeah, this is pretty too. Look at that. All right, I, I'm. I don't. I honestly don't know what I'll use these for, but they're gorgeous. I'm thinking <laughs> that I might use them, some of them as stencils, and use some of them in books. In my books, we'll see. Honestly, would like to get some thin thread and just hang them around because they're so pretty. Let's see if I can get this back in here. Put that away, maybe. Keep that sticky part away from it. There we go. Nice. Interesting. Dig it. And then this is the last pouch. Mo card is that, that, that the name of the company that these are by? <coughs> I can't grip it. There we go. This is all tied together. Forest letter series. Large vintage plant material paper. This is really pretty. All right. I'm digging that it's packaged so nicely. It's like a treat to open it. Isn't that nice? Okay, so we have some... Ooh, this is nice. It's got a little matte finish, little tag. Wish my nails were nicer. Right now, I got excited. I didn't think about the condition of my nails. Um, beautiful lightweight papers cut to shape and size oh these are so pretty aren't these pretty you guys for those of you who are not thrilled I apologize but I'm having a really good time right now um, those are very nice Ooh, these are nice 
there are more cardstock as is this little tag. The little tag is very cardstock. Um, you can cut this out or leave it like that and glue on top. Um, you can cut it um, however you want. You can do whatever you want with them. They're both I like this one better, but they're both very pretty. Look at those patterns. Looks like ink work with a little bit of watercolor wash. This one looks like it was a, might be a gouache design. Yeah, very cool. Then some. Ooh, very pretty and super sturdy envelope. That is super sturdy. That cardstock in and of itself looks beautiful. I might cut that up though. Or we could use it as a little tip in for things. Ooh, these are pretty. Different um, patterns on them. Isn't that nice? Is that peppers? Yeah, I think it is. Oh no, I think it's supposed to be leaves and berries or olives maybe. And then more flowers. Are they different? Yeah, they're slightly different flower patterns. Those are pretty. These are, ooh, these are, I like that texture. They're slightly textured, like almost fabric-y. These are very pretty as well. Sorry about the coughing. These are really pretty. Look at those. And then our last little bit, you guys, are these larger. See, this is gorgeous. Looks like delicate line work. Ooh. See that I just want to paint. <laughs> I want to throw watercolor at it. Which I may do before we scrapbook with it. Yeah, these are gorgeous. Oh, that's a bigger sheet. <gasps> How nice is that? Oh, that's nice. It's a beautiful design. Yeah, I really dig that. Also, it looks like delicate line work. And then we have for our last sheet, which is daisies, which are one of my favorite, favorite flowers. I love the pattern, the overall pattern. Isn't that pretty? Daisies, and aren't those irises back there? A little bit of baby's breast. <coughs> yeah, this is a really nice box. I am very excited to use this in future um, art journaling videos. If you guys are not interested in seeing art journaling um, and how I go about doing it, please let me know and I will make a completely separate channel for that kind of thing, for this kind of thing. Um, I prefer not to, but um, honestly, not everybody is here. Oh, I forgot about these little guys. Is here for my art journaling just experiments. Uh, Ooh, these are soft. They're silky feeling. Ooh! I think they're stickers. They're floral little... Because they feel like they have a backer on them. Let's find out. Yes? Little paper stickers. Pretty sure. I don't... does it say on here? Well, it does, but I can't read that. <laughs> I believe they're stickers. Um, I don't have the patience to fuss with them right now, even if they're not. Um, they're cut like they're stickers. But there's a bunch of different little floral... Oh, ooh, I like this one. That's really pretty. Ooh, look at this. Alright. <laughs> I'll just spread them around and we'll do a little close-up of them. papers out of the way. This tag is really nice too. Oops. I'll just spread them around. Look at that. I like these. These are pretty. It's a nice selection, right? Oh, 
pretty little flowers. Oh, that looks so nice spread out like that. Pretty little flowers. I'm inspired to draw and paint. Things like this inspire me to draw and paint and create. Um, yeah, these are really nice. I'm, I'm really, 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 really happy with this box. I was really nervous to subscribe to a box of like journaling supplies. Um, and when I say art journal, I mean art journal. I'm going to create my own. I'm going to make my own art journal. We're going to paint and draw in it. Um, I'm going to add um, off camera. I'll add like photos and um, maybe on camera. We'll see. Um, but there'll be photos and um, let me get this back in order here. There'll be photos and writing about what happened in the day, in the photo, how I feel, who's there, what's going on, that kind of stuff. Um, and the reasoning why I want to start um, doing artistic um, journaling. When I say journaling, I, I loosely um, oh, all of this was not in there. I want to put all of this in there. <laughs> oh, it's not big enough. These were not in there. This stuff was in there. I need to get little a little bit of storage for this stuff. But I probably won't do that until I have my own place next year after Christmas. But this is this is a crazy haul, you guys. This is a crazy haul of stuff. Um, cannot tell you how happy I am with everything that's in this in this uh, um, box. I'm gonna pull that out of there. <coughs> yeah. Let me know what you think. Um, if you're interested in seeing me experiment with all this stuff, um, my intention is to experiment with these as well. Um, stamp them down and then create over the top of them things like that incorporate all the papers and all the designs elements all the stickers well not all of the stickers but I mean this is a crazy crazy amount of stuff for 40 bucks 45 with shipping and the tissue paper is beautiful Look at that. Look at that deer. I love the deer. Looks like something I would draw. And the cute bird. And the holly. Yeah, I dig it. I dig it. Alright, you guys. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Um, and I will stop talking and, and stop ooing and oing and see you in the next video. Yeah. Bye.